dependency also known as weaker relationship sometimes a class may depend on another class for some of its use this is not a strict relationship and hence won't appear in the class diagram for example in the below code the customer class depends on a payment object for purchasing here payment is a local variable and not an attribute look at this customer has attributes like name age phone number and the payment has one only one attribute is named as type and uh, we are able to create uh, we have created object for a payment payment one is a card then we create a customer object with the three instances then to call out this method which is part of the customer class it has to depend on payment so now we check uh, it is being passed payment one is an object of the payment class so here the object payment is not part of the attribute section but it is treated as a local variable simply it gives us paying by card that's a message it is processed it checks payment type but it is card it says paying by card apart from an object being passed as a parameter to the method we can also create an object locally inside a method this again is a weaker dependency which does not reflect in the class diagram so the, the relationship which is not uh, represented in the class diagram reflected in the class diagram is called as weaker relationship or a dependency Although sometimes we may access the static values of another class directly in our method, this is again weaker relationship. Accessing the static values of another class directly in a method is known as weaker relationship. Look at this example: use of static customer care as a static variable helpline in class customer. Now, in this method call support, we are accessing a static variable of another class. So they say this is a weaker relationship look at this example we create object right um, so we have two cl two classes we have class uh, customer name bill customer type fine then method calculate bill then um, the tax has customer type only one attribute it has then we say check customer type equal to equal to student written 5 otherwise written 10 so now we are creating an object class customer 1 customer of Mary student 100 we pass it across then we call this our method calculate bill look at this calculate bill in the calculate bill method we are creating attribute for this object reference for class tax so this is also they say it's a weaker relationship so it has to return the bill amount bill amount is uh, if this is a five percent if the student is a five percent tax final bill is calculated based on that 100 is the amount and 5% uh, is the tax